family violence is a continuous issue on Guam. The Guam Police Department's domestic assault response team reported that in 2020, there were over 1,000 victims. In efforts to combat the rise in cases, Guam is taking on a plan of action called the Lethality Assessment Program. The launch comes from a collaboration between the Office of the Attorney General, the Guam Police Department's domestic assault response team, the Guam Coalition Against Sexual Assault and Family Violence, and victim advocates reaching out. Guam Coalition Against Sexual Assault and Family Violence Executive Director Cynthia Cabot. So with the lethality assessment program, oftentimes in those cases, these are women, for the most part, who are in a situation where they are often battered, and often abused, and then they are seeking assistance. LAP provides officers with a standardized checklist to follow when responding to matters of family violence or sexual assault. You're asking very personal questions of these victims. Have they ever tried to kill you? Have they ever threatened to kill you Have, or your children? Have they ever threatened to kill themselves? If a person answers yes to any of those, they are deemed a high-risk victim, and at the end of the questions, an officer will immediately connect them to support and safety planning services. Hannah Devonzo for KUAM News.